you know, sometimes you just have to go out and take a walk. And that's what I'm doing today on this wonderful overcast day today. Today is day 36 of my vitrectomy and the aftermath. Um, I'm feeling really blessed. I know I always say that, but I think it's really important when looking at things, looking at the glass half full instead of half empty. For me, the blessings that I have are the fact that I'm on a dinner break and I can go out and walk around. Now it's COVID-19 pandemic, you know, is still going on. And I've been fortunate enough that the majority of the time I've been working from home. But there are times when I do have to go into work. And today is just one of those times. So I'm actually walking outside of the property, just trying to get some fresh air because I've just been looking at the computer monitor for way too long. And I just needed a break. I needed some nature. I needed some trees. I needed to feel the fresh air. And so here I am talking to you, sharing this moment in time as I spend the last few minutes before I go back, back into work. Um, it's tough. Uh, my eye is, you know, tired and um, rightly so. This is just part of the process and, you know, I have to work. So here I am, you know, doing my very best, contributing as much as I can contribute. Um, I enjoy the work that I do. I also enjoy sharing this moment with you. And I so appreciate you walking on this journey with me. So again, I hope me sharing these moments, whether good or bad, when I say good or bad, meaning difficult and yet easy, happy or sad, that you realize that, that I shed some light about the healing process. That, you know, it's not all cookies and cream, you know, and we go through things. And I just think it's important um, to share that. And I mean, I'm going through this during a pandemic. So you add the aspect of, you know, not being around people, being able to hug and touch and, and just be close and, you know, just eating breaking bread together um, unless you're you know a close-knit family you all live under the same household it's been really really tough so I just want to let you know that you are not alone it doesn't you don't have to be going through some kind of medical um, thing like a surgery or illness of any kind but that the fact that we are all here dealing with um, this new normal and that it's okay to talk about how you feel about what's going on in your life what you, whether it is I'm just not having a great day and there are a lot of great ways that you can you know take that energy and put it into something like dancing or singing um, or doing art which is I'm a firm believer that art heals so I I would like to offer you this idea. If you have time, spend some time just doodling or, you know, putting a puzzle together or gathering leaves and making some kind of cool, you know, mosaic or something, whatever. We are all little artists inside. So tap into that inner artist of yours. That's what I'm going to do. Well, now I have to get back to work. Thank you for listening and supporting me during this journey. And I, as always, as, as always, I want to wish you love, light, and most of all, joy.